What is happening, everybody? Welcome back to Dark Horse Sports Cards. You got Brody and Silver Sage. It's been a hot minute, but we're back in action. And no, we are not ripping basketball today, folks. We have a new product out. It's Baseball Sage. I know you're happy. Yes, I love baseball product. And this one, th there's a lot of different baseball products. So if you're new... This, there's three Bowman releases that happen throughout the year. Bowman draft, we already experienced that. We tried to hunt for Tom Brady. This is, Terrible decision. This is Bowman baseball, and then Bowman chrome will be later in the fall in Q4. That's going to be fire. So, That's going to be fire. Uh, what, what, these, what Bowman is all about is prospects. So you're hunting players who have yet to play in the major leagues. So – I got a list here of top prospects that we're going to be hunting, but Dylan Cruz is probably the number one guy we're looking for. I would say he might be, he, he's not the Wimby of the set, but he's the number one guy, I believe. But now some might be asking, Hey, Silver Sage, you're the baseball guy. Why aren't you ripping this? <laughs> well, unfortunately, Silver Sage lives out in Vegas. And it is impossible to get product. So <laughs> I, I saw these on the shelves and I was like, I know Sage probably wants to see these ripped. Yes. So we've got six of them today to rip through. Uh, just reading through the box here. Yeah. On the front, we are looking for the rare retail exclusive green parallel cards. Um, we are looking for nothing there. And nothing there. There, and there are so many Chase. inserts and yeah. Yeah, Chase, extremely limited legendary first Bowman cards and hitting gems inserts. Look for retail Rainbows. green ex parallels numbered to 99 along with a rainbow of other colored parallels. Keep an eye out for retail exclusive paper prospect autographs as well as chrome sp prospect and chrome rookie autographs. Collect the coveted first Bowman cards for top prospect Walker Jenkins, Brock Wilkin, George Lombard Jr., Erjan, Nimali, and more. Look for super limited autograph versions of select inserts. So that's what we're dealing with here. So yeah, Walker that. Walker Jenkins is a big name too. Uh, but the but the cool thing about baseball is there's going to be so many different types of parallels, color, oh everything. It's just going to be wild. 12 cards per pack here. And uh, we're going to fast rip this a little bit. Um, if you guys haven't checked us out on Whatnot... Uh, I've been opening a lot of packs lately, so it is something that I'm getting a little bit more comfortable with and, uh, it's been fun. How do these, <laughs> so we're going to do a little, we're going to do a little fast rip. How here. do these packs feel compared to the football packs you've been ripping? These, they feel kind of high quality. <laughs> I'm not going to lie. They do feel nice. We'll start here with uh four to start us off. So Sage, you tell me when to stop because I won't really know. Okay, so Topps product is known for the rookie card, and they still right have here. rookie cards in Bowman, but nobody really cares about rookie cards in the Bowman product. It's all about the first and the prospects. So this is this is nothing. But you know my guy, Ellie De La Cruz. If you still pull a rookie card of Ellie De La Cruz, it's still going to be worth something. Uh, what about the guy that's dating uh, uh, Livy? Dunn? Yes, Paul Skeens. Yes, he'll be. He just made his debut the other week, and uh, he had a. He only went four and a third, but uh, then the rain came. He ended up not getting the win, but the Pirates won. It was. Uh, he throws one oh two. It's pretty sweet. Uh, I would just. Some of these inserts aren't too expensive. You're looking for first. Okay, there it is. And there's a first. And that's a paper first, right? So you want Chrome first. Yeah. And you want numbered cards in color. That's what we're looking for. But uh, There's Chrome, but not first if, of anything. If we miss something, please in the comments let us know. <laughs> I'm 100% just putting this in a box and shit. <laughs> hey, there's your guy. Yeah, two, two, two hands, hands, Andrew Abbott. He's off to a decent start. That's Lou Bob right there. He's always injured. He's injured again this year. Vlad. Ooh. Prospect power up. That's a cool looking card. Yeah. Uh, Roman Anthony there. Okay. It's not numbered on the back or anything, is it? I'm not seeing. Uh, no, that's, that's just going to be an insert. Yeah. Yeah. I'm not numbered. seeing Roman Anthony. Oh, uh, there's a Bowman, Bowman first there. Yes. Or... He's on my sleeper prospect list. Okay. There Yolan we go. I'll put him over in the sleep. Sleeper. Dylan Head. Michael Arreo. 
Oh, Junior can you? Oh, put that on there. Yeah. Junior Max. Oh, this guy's good. Two, I know this two guy. Two different color eyeballs if you look closely. But yeah. Oh really? Yeah. He's like Moose Man. He's like a <laughs> Moose Man. We were looking at him. He was like on his back one time. We we're like, gosh, he's such a weird looking dog. <laughs> but if you cover, if you cover his weird looking eye, he looks like an old uh. dog. It's the fact that he has two different eye colors. That's why he like always looks kind of awkward. Bryce That's Harper. my guy, my jersey. All right, this looks like a parallel here. No? Am I crazy? Oh, it is. There's the number. Is that the retail 50, blue? 58 of one. Ooh, there you go. Max Wagner. Okay. 58 of 150. That looks like the first number card we've got here. Yes. And uh, unfortunately, it's not a first. So he's had a different prospect. It's not a rookie, not a first. But every once in a while, the big guys will have uh, that. Those cards will be worth something. Oh, this. That's a cool looking. This card. guy's one of the top. Uh, he was a top prospect, but now he's up. And I guess he hasn't been doing well. They just benched him for four games. So he came back. After four game benching, they said they wanted him to just watch some baseball for a little bit. You know you're bad when you're. What the heck does that? And you have to just watch. <laughs> hey, hey, don't play anymore. Just watch. We'll just we'll just let you watch. These are quite Schwarber, cool cards. I will say. Schwarber has a 33 percent home run percentage when he gets a hit. It's like the fourth highest all time. So when when he oh. oh! Auto in the first box. What do you know about this guy? Jordani De Los Santos. This guy looks scared right now. Cool auto, though. I don't know much about Pitt this guy. Pittsburgh Pirate. Wow. Point an auto in the first box. Um, All right. Yeah. That's kind of cool. I'm, I'm trying to look him up. Uh, yeah, he, seem, he seems fine. All right. Another one of these cards. These cards are cool. Yeah. I'm all about cool cards. That's a cool card yes. there on the Chrome. Uh, Israel Drake. Uh, Isaiah Drake, excuse me. Any Ryan. Burrow. Any autos in uh, Blaster Retail is great. Here's our first Bowman Chrome. Yes, Bowman Chrome first. There we go. That's one of the top Jared cards. Jared Serna. Um, Maybe not the guy we're looking for. And a Brooks Lee there. So we only got one of those so far. We still have two more packs left, but we only got one of those in our uh, first box. Yeah. Dang. That guy's... Baseball kind of loads loads up these boxes, yeah. man. Oh. We got a number card and an auto already. I wish I could be opening those right now. I'm so jealous. Well, if I find any more, I'll send them <laughs> your way, and then you can, you can rip them. All right, so we got some base here. Only really looking for Dela Cruz if we see him. Ooh. Rookie of the year. Oh, Luciano. Marco Luciano. That's a cool. Is that, is that green? Yeah. What is that? It's like a green. I don't know. Yeah. I can't tell. It's like a green hollow. It's not numbered or anything, but that is a cool looking card. Yeah. You're going to love doing the inventory on all these. <laughs> Jared Elkins, Jacob Wilson. Jacob Wilson. That's my guy. What does that mean? I, I PC that guy. Oh, well, you can take his car. Here we go. First Bowman Chrome, Jacob Burke. Okay, let me check my list. Jacob Burke. Cool card. Yeah, I don't see him anywhere. All there's right. a lot. There's a big Bro. checklist on this on these sets, unfortunately. A bunch of rookies here. Trout. Oh, wait. Who's the Japanese guy that's really good? You passed him already. Uh, he's the pitcher for the Dodgers. Wait, Shohei Otani. You're not talking Shohei Otani. No, no, the Yagamata. Yeah, you passed him a little bit. I was going to bring him up. I was so many players. But his but his card doesn't really matter in this set like this. Ooh. 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 Is that like a Wait, what is, is it this? a lunar? First Bowman, another Cepeda. Yeah. What is this card? Is this numbered? See, that's the only thing I don't like about this set, Sage, is they don't have anything on the box, so I know what this is. I think it's a lunar glow parallel. Does it look like that's does it look sick. like a moon around the sides? Yeah. Oh yes, yes, right here. Yeah. That looks like moon. Yeah, okay. Lunar glow parallel. One in twelve that's packs. Pretty... And they have different colors. Oh. Okay, so not not super rare. Enough to where I can just drop the card and not feel too bad yeah. about it. Okay. 
Uh, one in twelve packs isn't super rare. That's one in every box. But that's a cool card. Yeah. Uh, and then two chromes of people I've never. And heard. more importantly, All right. no first. No, that's the first box. What do you have to say about the first? We box? got an auto. I... You can never complain about an auto in a retail. We might not get another auto the rest of the way. I am pleasantly surprised, honestly. Yes. That was for not knowing any of the players. That's still a pretty fun rip. Yes. Look at me trying to show that the box is empty. <laughs> so Walker Jenkins, Dylan Cruz, Aiden Miller, Brock Wilkin, Robert Calez, Luis Baez, George Lombard Jr., Aiden Smith, Cooper Pratt. Those are some of the guys we're looking for on my on my list here of the top prospects. Now, what's our strategy with these cards? Are you keeping some of these to see what happens with them? Are we trying to sell them immediately? What's what's your strategy here? Yeah, I would say I would say I really need to familiarize myself with just the Bowman pro this product because I've opened a lot of Bowman Chrome and I which is all Chrome cards and I've opened a lot of Bowman Draft thanks to this channel, but I really don't have too much experience with this. So, my understanding is they save some of the prospects from the draft so, so they can make another product. It's like they delay some of these uh, first cards to get through to the next um, product. So there's still some firsts. So what I would say is everybody's probably excited about those first cards. So um, just like anything, you'd if you're going to sell them, you'd want to sell them right away. Oh, Cooper Pratt. Yeah, there we go. But it's paper, but it's still fine. But we need sleeve? we need that in Chrome. Nah, you don't need to sleeve it. Don't even sleeve it. Wow. Yeah. It's no respect for the first. Bowman probably like seventy five cents. Wow. Oh, there's our guy Paul oh, Skeens. Paul Skeens, one hundred two. Yeah, I watched his debut. It it was pretty fun. Of course, they interviewed the uh, Livy for a half an inning. Well, yeah, that's that's gonna be a Taylor Swift situation, <laughs> yes. right? That they're gonna they're literally gonna suck that as far as they can. Yes. Literally just take as many of her fans as possible. Why not? I All right. So I guess you get like one of these in every box. Maybe a couple of these every box. They are still cool cards. Yeah. Not not super rare. Aiden Smith, Walker Jenkins. These are all paper. Jackson Morrell. All right. Here we go. That's our Chrome. Alan Castro for the Red Sox. Is our Bowman Chrome out of that? Six or three boxes. Yeah, three boxes. if it's a Bowman, Bowman Chrome first, it's still going to be a hold no matter what the prospect is. Baseball is so weird that you can have because you never know. you can have superstars popping up out of anywhere in the draft. Mm. I mean, that happens in football too, right? Uh, the top Tom Brady, no, Brock Purdy, but uh, it definitely does. But it's less likely. Yeah, baseball sure. has like twenty five rounds. It's insane. Ooh, lunar glow. We have we have. We have another lunar here. All right, I think I can fly through these because these are just the yep. paper, right? All right, rookie here. That's another one of those like kind of green silver cards. Yep, prospect. Uh, paper, paper. All right, here we go. Yes. Dylan Cruz. But wait, is it Chrome? Okay, yeah. this is the best card in the thing. Sleeve this one up. This is probably like a ten, fifteen dollar card. Oh, nice. Yes, he's the number one guy, and you got the Bowman Chrome. There we go. All right. Let's I'm go. happy with that one. All right. Sage is happy. I'm happy. Jason right. Dominguez, that's one of the three rookies that I would save or put, put to the side. Okay. I mean, you're going to go yeah, yeah, yeah. again. I, I I have no idea. There's Michael Harris. Too. Uh, we got his autograph. Yes. He's the man. Yeah, that guy's awesome. All right. Here we go. Blake Mitchell. That's going to be on the loop. Yeah. Hmm. Okay. Disappointing. Um, Oh, okay. Carlos Sanchez. John Cruz? John. On the Bowman Chrome? He's first. a Yankee, so we'll always take it, but no, I don't see All him right. on any top list here. Marcelo Mayer. Luciano. A bunch of paper here. Another one of these inserts that I like a lot, but Sage doesn't really mm -hmm. care. Aiden Miller oh, on the paper. Aiden Miller, he's the top guy. Top three guy. Paper? But it's paper. It's fine. All right, we continue, continue on. Continue on. Ortiz. Ooh, Honeyman. That's a cool name. Hmm. 
Bryce Eldridge. That's our guy in the new show, hey. Yeah. Turns Bryce out Eldridge, they told him he right can't is. pitch anymore and he just needs to hit bombs. So I'm sure he was probably okay with that. Yeah. As long as they were going to pay him just as much money, right? Correct. Pay me the money and I'm fine with just hitting bombs. <laughs> What do you think's better if you had to pick between? Oh, look at this one. I think this is gonna have a monster. Oh boy. Look at this box. Um, Just absolutely someone eating it. What What do you think's better, hitting bombs or throwing strikeouts? If you could do both really well, yeah. What would you? A lot to unpack do? there, but ne- the the baseball card market values hitters a lot more. No, no, no. no. You as a baseball. No, no, no. Player I know. I was getting there because. Oh. Ooh, Ellie. All right. Oh. Oh, Shohei. Is this a God Pack? God Pack? <laughs> All legends. No, what I was saying is the baseball card market values the hitters because they can have 20, 20 year careers and pitchers, their arm eventually falls off. So if you're going to be a major league player and you got to pick, you can make a lot more money. And you can sustain your career a lot longer. So if your question is, is do I want my son to be a pitcher or a hitter? You got to go hitter. But if you're saying for one season or one game, yeah. Isn't this your guy? Oh, he's one of the three guys that I would put apart. Evan Carter, Ellie De La Cruz, and Jason Dominguez. Those are the only three rookies really worth it in Bowman. Yeah, you like Evan Carter. Hey, and if I'm wrong about some of this stuff, guys, please tell me in the comments if you're a baseball savant. You're ne- you're never wrong. You're, <laughs> you're silver safe. All right. Um, Miles Naylor is going to be our Bowman Chrome first here. Always a good thing to say, but not on my list. Okay. Elijah Green. Gunner. There's He's Gunner. He's just off to a good, great start this year, Gunner. Cunha. Adams. Luis Arise just got traded. Oh, is that Ellie? All right. Okay. Ooh, that's, that's that's sick. He's off to a great start, too. This guy, he's so fun to watch, Brody. You would love him. Every time he hits a single, he, Im- he's just so he fast. immediately steals second. And that that's common, right? But then he immediately steals third every time. He has like really? he he's on pace for like over a hundred steals in the rec in shattering the record. So we'll see if he stays healthy. Oh my gosh. But uh he just steals Ronnie Hernandez. We out on this guy? Yo ha- yo yo handy Morales <clears throat> also on the first chrome? Yeah, not seeing these guys. Oh, he's on my sleeper. He's the fourth sleeper pick. Fourth Nationals prospect. All right, sleeper pick. Uh, Enrique, Johanny Morales again, paper, and then two chromes, not first. But Ellie's making a lot of errors in the field. He leads like the league in errors. What is he playing? He plays shortstop. Oh, you can't you can't be making errors at shortstop. He's got he's got some highlight plays already, and he throws the ball so hard, and he gets a crow hop into it. So he's chucking them like 105 to the first baseman. Is that necessary or is he just flashy? Like Most that? of the time it's not necessary, but when he gets the guy by a split second, it looks pretty sweet. That's sick. But when he short hops the first baseman and the first baseman can't pick it, it he gets yeah, an that's air. Not <laughs> that's not good. All right. We are getting a lot of cards here, folks. J.D. Gonzalez. Never heard of him. All right, perfect. Um, Tenya, Bichette, Matt Olson, Colton Kowser. Oh, here we go. That's a first Bowman on a loop. Yes. Jared Dickey. Let me look. Might as well sleeve it up. Yes. I mean, that's one in every 12 packs, and it's a first Bowman. Yes, that's what I'm talking about. Leave it up. Leave it up. Yes. Uh, behind it, we got Luke Adams. Haven't seen another number card yet. Brock Wilkin on the first Bowman Chrome. Oh, That's yeah. So pro- Six Brewers, the sixth overall Brewers prospect. He's in one of the top ones. So that's a nice one. Oh, okay. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Um, that's going to be Colt Emerson for the Mariners there. Tony Cole Emerson was one of the top Mary. ones in uh, 
the Bowman draft. Dude, we're getting this is our new favorite so guy. This guy. This is our new favorite. We're getting all the we're getting Cepeda. Yeah, Yolin Cepeda. So much- Cespedes. So much Cepedes. Cespedes. Cep- I wonder Cepedes. if he's related to the other Cespedes. Oh, there's multiple Cepedes? Yeah, but the other guy's out of the league, but he was a fun player. Dude, these cards are going all over the place, Sage. Oh, my gosh. The paper and chrome combo is, is a nightmare. Yeah. I should I should have separated That's the two. That's okay. We're, we're slipping sliding all over the place. All right, we're down to the last three boxes. I, I really hope that one auto was not the only auto. I think you'd be you cr- like, I think you'd be very rare to pull two autos out of six blasters. I hope we do it, but you're like uh, that's probably gonna be our only auto. Yeah. And I was really hoping that you were lying when you said. I that. hope I'm lying too. I hope we get two more autos. But we'll see. So yeah, I mean, do all these do all these guys sign in here? I think the majority of them sign fanatics and. They're not doing anything weird. Tops, yeah. It's all well, – you don't have any Panini, Fanatics type of issue in baseball. Back and forth? Yep. Okay. So the people who uh, wouldn't sign would just be because they couldn't uh, sign in time, so they would use Redemptions. But they're trying to get away from Redemptions. James Wood there on the Prospect Power. Yeah, he's a top, he's a top guy, but it's not his first card. Baptist. All right, we're looking for something weird here, some parallels. Ooh, like ooh, that. Ooh. Like what that is that? To 75. Oh, oh, that is a this is one of the three guys I told you, Jason Dominguez, the Martian. He's a monster. He's uh still injured, but he's coming back soon to hit for the Yankees. Any Yankee player is good and especially their top guy. So that's a big pull right there. Nice, the 75. Yes. Let me price check Cole, that. Not- Colt Montgomery, Brock Wilkin, Ronnie Hernandez. I'll call out anything that I see that you think. Ooh wee! That's like um. Oh, I was gonna see if it was a jersey match, but he's like number ninety-nine. Oh yeah, it's definitely not my ninety-nine. Jared Dickey, and there we go. Yeah, there's no there's no sales of that card, but there is one listed for sixty five dollars, whatever that means. Oh, really? Hmm. The three ninety nine sold I mean, it's for three hundred or for three hundred for thirty. It's a very new car, yeah, or a very new product. Yeah. so maybe it's fifty dollars like card. Like... That's nice. All right. Yeah, you got the one yeah. yellow on the on one of the three rookies that we needed it on. So that's really lucky. We love that. Let's get a Bowman Chrome first parallel. Yes. Is, if that's even possible. Um, oh, it's right. possible. Another one of these rookie of the year favorites. Rodriguez, Rucker. All right, Jack Hurley now. There he is. There he is again. Another one. Hope to see it. A lunar of Sebastian Walcott. Isaiah Drake, Burroughs, Ledbetter, Jared Cerna on the Bowman Chrome first. Holiday, Henry Davis. Wait, what, what was the holiday? Uh, oh, yeah. Holiday. He had his major league debut, and he and he, he was the top number. Oh, it was very yes. bad. Yes. It was very bad. Yes. Like, everyone's very sad because they spent so much money on yep. his card. and <laughs> they crap. sent him down. Hey, he's still very young. It's still early. But, yeah, if you're an investor, I know, if you're an investor, if you, bought a whole <laughs> you are not happy right now. <laughs> uh, Abraham Nunez on the Chrome. Oh, Anyone yeah. For Nunez. He's in my sleeper. All right, he's in your sleeper pick. All right, two boxes, Sage. I feel like we've done pretty good. Yeah, that that Dominguez, that was nice. Pay, that paid for a couple boxes. I want to say these were about thirty dollars a yeah. box. Does that seem that about seems right, right for baseball? Seems right for paper and a little chrome. So we bought we bought uh what is it is six six of these. Mm-hmm. So about about one hundred and eighty dollars here, and that one card right there. Hopefully, is a third of that. Yes. 
And then you can kind of piecemeal yourself back too, right? Yes. With a lot of these $3, $4, $5 cards. Yep. Ooh, this is a thin pack. Maybe there's something good in this one. That's thin. Yeah, so... Normally you want thick packs, but that's thin. I mean, all these sports are wild with all their different releases, but there's really eight... Oh, this is the guy. Oh, yeah. Yep. He's... He actually got just completely crushed his first start and has done really well since. He got his ERA all the way back down to two. Well, he just needed, you know, he just needed to get lit yeah. up to realize his potential. Um, that's all. That's all. It was. Yeah. So there's eight really. Uh, Garcia there, Bowman Crows firm. Yeah, eight product releases, five tops and three Bowman throughout the year, and then there's a bunch of specialty stuff. So, baseball's wild, man. Yeah, they got they got a lot of well, I mean, baseball's wild. Look at football. Yeah. Football's got so many different I just told you about a product that we have coming up that you're like, what yeah. the heck? You bought I, that? I don't, I don't even know, know what that is yet. Enrique Jimenez. Jimenez. Look. See if that's anyone that we're uh looking nope. after. Trout. Okay, there's a trout. Spencer Steer. Drew Jones. Jared Cerna, another one of those. Uh, Anthony Huezo and Spencer Nives. Nope. All right. Nope. Nope. Oh, that Jason Demina, Dominguez guy is on. Oh, there's a Ellie de la Cruz. All there. right. Um, that Jason Dominguez guy is on the box. There he is. I didn't even realize that was him on the box. I should have known that that's the big hit. He's on the freaking that's, box. That's a pretty right. lucky pull right there. Out of 75. Like, how many number of cards have you seen? And you just happen to get that guy. We've seen three. Yeah. Evan Carter again. Yep, pull him. Uh, we have, I think, two or three. There's a rookie, Nolan Chanel. Chanel. Yeah. Max Wagner, Clifford, Johanda Morales, first Bowman. There's Shohei. Hello. Yeah, the Yohandi Morales guy is... Um, well, like a base a, Shohei like this, will that still go for like a couple bucks, no. you think, now? Or is that hype gone? Even in the hype, there's just too many of those cards. Oh, okay. Jordan Paper. Adams, Acuna. They just print the crap out of that. Oh, here we go. Bowman first on the Lunar, another one. Wow. John Weimer. Wimmer. At least we got another one of those. Yeah, on first. that's nice. nice. Yeah, he's not on these this list. This is just one list I have of the top like twenty guys. Oh sure, yeah, sure, sure, sure. There's Ellie. Ellie. That will be a couple bucks because it's very okay, nice. We'll set that off to the side. Um, Drew Gilbert on this. It looks like you get one of these in every yeah. box, so that definitely makes it not as cool. Diego Benitez and Ryan Clifford. All right, Sage, we have made it to the final box. Give the people what you think of this product so far, getting into the final box. Yeah, I like it. Uh, I am still working myself into prospecting. So if you guys have any tips or tricks or know some of these prospects that we went over, please let us know. I love learning about it. And uh, honestly, I got, I got into the Bowman draft product almost after we did our videos, I kind of trial by fire. So once again, this is trial by fire for me, but um, I spend a lot of my time on the current MLB players. So it's hard for me to get into the prospects too, but um, once you get into prospecting though, it's fun because you start to see them come through the leagues and then you start to know everything. So I want to learn more about it. So if you guys have any, helpful resources or tips or anything let me know but other than that yeah we also we need to get you some dang product too because i don't want to do this <laughs> i like i like you opening the baseball and me either watching you and ali open it or <laughs> me being a secondary commentary i don't i don't like the pressure of having to open it my there's just so many players yeah yeah, I don't know any of these cats. Uh, Alan Castro, I feel like we've already pulled one of him. You weren't very excited about that. <laughs> um, let's see. Bunch of rookies here. Bunch of Who's that guy right there? Which one? 
Oh yeah. He's he's up now and he's having a little bit of a slow start, but the Orioles just have so many so many young studs. Wait, did we get an auto of this guy? This little Max Clark guy? He looks familiar. Or is that not it? This guy's the top prospect in the draft one that we were hunting. I don't think we got a Max oh, Clark auto, okay. but he's a top guy. Okay. There he is there right there. He looks fast. I'm not sure if he's like sliding all yeah. over the place. Chase Davis. All right, come on. Let's go out with a bang here. Did we really just pull an auto in the first box and not not another single auto? That's fine. Yeah. All right. We got I a Dylan Cruz, man. We got three I wonder how much more that Dylan here. Cruz is. I'm going to look that up. Three more here. Come on. Come on, Bowman. Bowman 2024. Yeah. All right, so the Dil Dylan Cruz base is like a $10 card. But a numbered one of those, just even out of 199 is a $150 card. So Dylan Cruz color is really the, the hit. Oh, the, the big one that you want. Um, I don't know. I don't look Lunar Glow. Here. We'll just throw through, fly through some of the... Ooh. 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 Alan Castro to 250 All right. We we did get something. Take that on the purple. It is paper though. Yeah, it's it's weird. They have the paper parallels and the chrome parallels. Yeah. There it is. All right. Well, hey, another number card. Uh, Curtis Mead. Ortiz. Honeyman. There's the Bryce Eldred again. Jackson Holiday. Eat your heart out. <laughs> Um, is this Mariners guy Gabriel Gonzalez mm -hmm. on the mm -hmm. uh lunar there? Yep, that is a sick card. I do like the lunar. Yep, that's a cool parallel. I am a fan of it. Jacob Gonzalez, is that right. Dominguez again? The second card, so. oh, oh yeah, yeah. There, there you go. Another one, in. hey, stack those away, or I'll sort them for you. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I'm saying them all to you, Sage. I don't know who the flip I'm looking at. There's a Cooper Pratt, Skeens, Acuna, and a Homer Bush Jr. to finish. All right, so our big hits here. We got a numbered purple card out of 250. There we go. We got a card out of 70. $50, $50 card low. right there. That's super low number. That's crazy. Uh, this ended up not being as rare as we thought. Ella de la Cruz. There's a Dylan Cruz. We got one of his yes. chrome. That's nice. We got an auto. Very cool. And a Max Wagner out of 150. Though. All right. I don't know. I feel like we did pretty good. We got one, uh, one, we got three autos. So in about every other box, we got an you auto. You mean, uh, numbered. Numbered. Yeah. yeah. One auto in six boxes, every other box a numbered card. Um, so, yeah, I mean, it's a fun rip. Yeah. Uh, the auto it's and the rip. Jason Dominguez, without those two, it would have been bad, but I think that helped us a lot. Recoup some of our money definitely back. Sa definitely saved it a little bit. Yeah. All right. Well, uh, Sage will definitely be getting more baseball, hopefully, to open in the future. I got to try to find a way to siphon over some baseball cards from, <laughs> from here to there. We got to find like an underground railroad or something that I can send yeah. baseball cards for cheap to you to rip. Yeah. Um, but yeah, it was fun. It was fun. Good, fun, a little good. I rip. love to see baseball back on the channel. So we'll have some more sprinkling in here or there too. Yeah. Sage will, Sage will go off to his lair to have to do all the inventory on this <laughs> stuff before he comes back, I guess. But Thank you guys so much for watching. We appreciate it. Thank you again for subscribing to the channel and supporting us, what we're doing here at Dark Horse Sports Cards. We really do appreciate all the sport, support, and we will see you in the next one. Keep ripping them packs.